Condolences have poured in today as Albertans react to the death of Alberta's 11th Premier, Don Getty, at the age of 82. He was one of the six original progressive Conservative MLAs elected to the legislature in 1967, and along with Peter Lougheed, would help to build the foundations of the Tory party dynasty that would go on to win successive majority governments in Alberta for more than four decades. But before he entered politics, he was a legend on the football field, playing 10 seasons with the Edmonton Eskimos and leading the team to two great Cup championships before he retired from football in 1965. When Peter Lougheed retired as the province's first PC Premier, Getty stepped up to the challenge of leading the party. But he inherited the province just as the economy tanked and oil prices began plummeting in 1985. Soon, oil had hit $8 a barrel and Getty was faced with a revenue stream that had dried up and pressure to cut spending. But he's also remembered as an early architect of Alberta's booming oil industry and as an unwavering federalist who gave Alberta a strong voice and pushed for constitutional reforms at the Meech Lake and Charlottetown Accords. He was also a staunch supporter of Senate reform. Today, Alberta is still the only province that holds elections to choose senators in waiting that are later appointed to the Red Chamber by the Prime Minister. But perhaps his most famous and far-reaching legacy was his creation of Family Day, held the third Monday in every February in Alberta. The holiday is also now celebrated in British Columbia, Saskatchewan and Ontario, and three other provinces celebrate their own version of the day. The province has set up an online memorial page and a condolence book has been set up in the legislature rotunda. More details on his state funeral will be expected in the coming days. For the Edmonton Journal, I'm Mariam Ibrahim.